uh, Fred wanted me to wanted me to do it because I was there, and he knew he could get me for minimum and didn't have to pay, uh, uh, you know, so many people, and I wanted to do it because I was a ham anyhow, and uh, I did it, and before we went, <coughs> before we started serious rehearsals, I was in the men's room one day, and and I heard these two actors talking, and one actor says. Well, I read for a part of so-and-so, whatever the part was, the gray man or whatever it was that I played. He said, I read for that, and I thought I had the part. But then that son of a bitch, J.P. Miller, decided he wanted to play it, so I was out of a job. And you know what? Actors' Equity actually called me up and said, uh, you know, when, you're, when you act in one of your own pieces, uh, you're cutting an actor out of a job. And I said, well, I'm awfully sorry about that, you know, but I'm giving about 50 actors a job by writing this piece. And I, you know, I, I think that the tradition allows me to, to do that once in a while. It's a very small part. I don't think you should chide me for that. And the, the lady who had called me up said, yeah, I know, but I have to make the call. <laughs> <laughs> tell us about the role that you played so people can see it. Then. Well, it's not a very big role. It's a, it's a role in which I sit by a drunk who, who, who has come in and who keeps interrupting the proceedings and I keep saying, the guy says, says uh, uh, what time is it or something like that and, um, and I say it's such and such and he says, oh I had a watch like that one time, that's a great watch, you know, I've done some stuff like that, you know, and um, you know, it's basically a bit, you know. I had a wonderful thing in the, in the show but we eventually cut it. I think we cut it out of both the film and the TV show, in which uh, uh, somebody, uh, the guy was getting so obstreperous, somebody said, let's put him out of here. And the guy who is, who is speaking, who is being interrupted, says no came in here on his own. He wants to be here. That's why he's here, because he's got that problem. We don't throw anybody out of here. What he's saying is more important than what I'm saying. He's saying, I need help. Pay attention. But we cut it. I don't know why. Time or whatever.